Look at that Desmond Shaw here. I've uh, been cutting a bit of timber today and I'm just going to show you what I have got. Now we have got red cedar which is very young. Got a nice red grain in it. I have never turned red cedar before. And I've got another one there that we're not too sure what that one is. This one under here is a pine of some kind, which comes off the same block down there. They're about 11 inches across. And these ones here are about 4 inches. They're, I think red cedar, just the small ends of it. Now we have the Macedonian nut, or Queensland nut, whatever you like to call it. There, I've got quite a bit of that, and I've cut pieces, so I could load them in the car, it's very heavy wood. This is uh, of a tree that was about two foot six across the bottom of the tree. These small pieces will make nice little platters, I've got to cut all the rot out of there. And we've got a pine here, I think it could be, it's either hewn pine, or it could be hoop pine. But I'm going to call it hoop pine because it's got hoops in it. And these blocks are probably 17 inches across and about 14 inches that way. And I had to cut it in half to be able to load it in my car. This big piece here is probably 13 inches across there. It's the Macedonian nut, like these ones down here. And there, they're about 8 inches, and I had to cut them down the middle to load them because they are heavier than these big pieces of uh, timber. So it's good to be able to pick up timber for nothing. You just got to have a, do a lot of hard work to get it. I've been probably two and a half hours on the chainsaw cutting all that into shape to be able to get it. A piece in here is Queensland nut. Nice big flat piece. I've got no idea what I could make out of it, but I'll do a lot of thinking while it's drying out. It'll take a few years for some of this to dry out. And a nice rich red sap comes out of it. This is the wood that looks like when I turned it on YouTube, I mean put it on YouTube, it, people said it looked like fish or uh, ham and all that stuff. And maybe it might be look like meat. This one will make a nice platter. It's about 15 inches long, 4 inches at this end and about 2 and a half at that end. Anyway, hope to see uh, some of this on YouTube in time to come. And over now for now.